There's Loop and Louie. There's Big Bird. And there's Prairie Dawn. Now we're going to go across the yard to the carriage house. That's where I used to work in the studio. The studio was upstairs and I'd work up there every day. Every day. This is the back door to the carriage house where I used to work. Upstairs is where I sculpted all the toys for years and years. Until I moved my studio into the house. This sort of became a storage place. It's more like a hoarder's place. There's so much stuff up there, it's unbelievable. But let's go look and see if it's worth cleaning out or not. Oh, creaky door. Oh, push. Oh, my gosh, you can hardly get in the room. But we'll go upstairs, so here's the side door and the little steps that go up. These are creaky steps. Uh, this used to be a hayloft for the horses in the carriage house, so I only came up here to drop hay down to the horses in their stall. But, oh look, there's Lupin Louie. Uh, there's a Tasmanian devil. I see Big Bird up there. It's a Barney. There's Prairie Dawn. Soap bottle. Ernie. There's a Bob the Builder. Oh, there's the first Sesame Street thing I did. It was that uh, horse pulling the wagon with Ernie, Oscar, and Big Bird. There's the Elmo clock. That was one of my favorites. This is a whole bunch of soap bottles character bottles that hold soap. We'll get into those at some point. Uh, made a lot of them. Mainly the Sesame Street ones there. I know those. And let's see, there's some more boxes of stuff. Oh my gosh, there's a dot matrix printer. Can't believe I still have that. And there's just boxes and oh my, Etch-a-Sketch. Etch there you go. There's a Jack in the Box Ernie. There's a Elmo sticking out. There's a rock and roll Ernie. Oh, and there's a Big Bird casting, vinyl. See lots of other. See Cookie. I see Kermit. I see a baby Kermit. I saw a Reptar in there too. Here's Ernie and some Big Birds. Some Batman figures. And who else is there? I see more Batman. There's Simba. Oh, there's Simba and Nala. And there's an R2D2. I saw Chucky and Tommy and Telly. Cookie Monster. And here's a basket of patterns and stuff, wax or clays. That I just as soon as I get done with them, I just stick them up in the basket and get it out of the way. Here's a four-foot Santa Claus I did for Christmas yard stuff. There's uh, Chucky, some Elmos. It's all kinds of stuff. Lots of different companies. Yeah, believe it or not, under all that pile right there is my desk. I used to sit and do all my phone calls and invoicing and all that kind of stuff from there. Wow. <laughs> Was I right? This place is full of stuff. Lots of toys. Tell you what, I'm going to get this place cleaned up. I'll get my desk back. I'll get my workspace back over there, the workbench, and we'll be able to shoot some episodes right here and I'll be able to tell you how the toys were made, some of the stories behind them, uh, the production, all that kind of stuff. So I'm getting excited. Maybe I'll be excited enough to start cleaning this thing right now. So thanks a lot. We'll see you next time. Looks like a sink.